Example 11.6. A small activated sludge wastewater treatment plant is expected to have a delivered equipment first cost of $273,000. The cost factor for the installation of piping, concrete, steel, insulation, supports, etc. is 0.49. The construction factor is 0.53 and the indirect cost factor is 0.21. Determine the total plant cost if the indirect cost is applied to A, the cost of the delivered equipment, and B, the total direct cost. Whenever you encounter a problem that talks about cost factors and also that refers to a plant, here we have a treatment plant, that means that you will be using the factor method to estimate the costs. Okay, so like I said, the factor method it's mainly for plant costs. Uh, and this is a formula. It looks very simple. You have the total cost, that's the one that you're gonna calculate, is gonna be equal to H. We call this the overall cost factor or the sum of individual cost factors, which I'll show you right now where to get that from. And that's going to be multiplied times the total cost of the major equipment in that plant. Okay, so for H, okay, it says that it's the sum of the individual cost factors. So all of the factors that are mentioned in the problem are going to be added and then you're going to add one to it. That would be H. That's one way of doing it. The other way is if the problem is telling you to apply or to estimate the indirect costs separately. Okay, so the H will not include the indirect costs. Okay, so here, this is H okay because remember that is CE times H and this is the formula from this slide and then you're going to have a separate indirect cost factor over here which is a F capital I subscript plus one okay so you have to make sure or you have to read the problem carefully to see which one you will be using okay so just uh, going back to slide number three here they tell you the difference between the direct and the indirect costs. But the problem will say which one of these two you will be using. In the event that the cost components are not defined in the problem, maybe they don't tell you what the, the factors are going to be, then you will be using H equal, oops, H equal to 4 as your default. Okay, so it would be this one right here. Okay, so we have the problem. Let me list what we have. So here it's a delivered equipment. So pay attention to what type of cost is being given in the problem. Okay, so if it's the equipment, then this is going to be your CE. And then you are given uh, a cost factor for installation uh, of these elements right here. So we have, this is factor, and I'm going to use subscript 1, 0.49. Construction factor, I'm going to use this as F2. And then indirect cost factor. I'm going to call this F3, or you can just say that this is your F, capital I. This would be 0.21. Just to uh, differentiate them, I'm just going to write down that these two are part of the direct costs, and this one right here will be indirect. Ok, 
Okay, so now that we have everything, we must solve for the total plant cost. So we will be solving for CT. Part A of the problem, he wants us to calculate CT uh, if the indirect cost is applied to the cost of delivered equipment. Okay, so I'm going to write here that indirect cost will be applied to the cost of equipment or in other words we will be applying it to CE okay, so that means that we're going to have everything together so we said that the formula is CT H times the cost of the equipment. Let's calculate age. One plus the sum of the individual factors. It's going to be one plus, and then again, since we are applying the indirect cost to the cost of the equipment, we add all three together using this formula right here or this one right here okay because remember we are going to apply it to the cost of the equipment okay so now it's going to be 1 plus 0.49 plus 0.53 plus 0.21 is going to give us a total of 2.23 and then we just plug in the values 2.23 times 273,000 which is going to give us a total cost of 608,790 So this is the total cost for part A. Now part B wants us to determine the total cost if the indirect cost is applied to the total direct cost. Okay, so indirect cost is applied to direct Okay, so in this case, or in this scenario, our age will consist only of the direct cost factors. So my age will be 1 plus, again, the sum of Fi, which is going to be 1 plus 0.49 plus point 53. It's going to give us a factor of 2.02. Then again, for a reference, this is direct cost factors only. Kay. And then when we plug it in, or when we break down the CT formula is going to look like this. It's going to have the, to the cost of the equipment, okay, 1 plus the sum of Fi, and then we have 1 plus the factor for the indirect cost. Just to break it down, we have uh, cost of the equipment, we have the age for direct, and then we have indirect. Okay, applied to this formula. Then we just plug in the values. Maybe 273,000 times, this is what we got from here, 2.02. 
and then times 1 plus the indirect cost factor is F3, which is going to be 0.21. And the answer for this one will be 667,267.